Good evening everybody, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel, uh, I'm Evo Reg and in this video I'm going to bring you hopefully a short clip, uh, a little bit of a project review, um, things I like, things I dislike, things I do a little bit differently, um, I hope you enjoy. Uh, so uh, just completed on the desk today we have an Invicta Tactical Warsuit. Um, I fell in love with this kit, the second I saw it on GW uh, shelf, picked it picked it up and it's sort of thrown me straight, straight back into uh, Space Marines. Um, bear in mind I haven't, uh, haven't painted a Space Marine for about seven years. Um, this guy has been done in an Imperial Fists colour scheme to match some that I started seven years ago. Uh, if we jump to the carousel we can see the finished project so overall this guy's taken me uh, about two weeks two weeks on and off painting in an evening after work um, did uh, a little bit over the weekends but um, not a great deal of painting time uh, did a lot with the airbrush uh, the kit it's quite a complicated kit uh, especially when you're trying to build sub assemblies and sub components did make uh, a couple of mistakes which I'll explain in a, in a, in a few minutes um, but, uh, this guy yeah, going round I've got his um, stubble weapon on the back that is magnetised at the elbow joint so um, it's a little bit of a snug fit but it does uh, it does uh, come off um, quite nicely so if I uh, jump to here, so um, yeah, like, like I say, overall pretty chuff, pretty chuffed with the way this guy came out. Um, he matches the rest of the army, which after uh, you know painting the colour scheme seven years apart was quite a challenge in itself. Um, I was really pleased how the face came out on this guy. Uh, tried to uh, put the base colours down with an airbrush than the face this time. Um, you know, spraying shadows from the bottom and highlights from above, etc. Um, uh, so that was a little bit different, but uh, overall turned out really well. I was quite quite pleased with it. Uh, the burnt barrels, um, was really really happy with the way they turned out. Um, and uh, and the yellow, the 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 yellow matched the 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 guys that I've got in the cabinet already. So. Um, so I was really chuffed, really chuffed with that. Uh, things, things that I didn't like. Uh, I think uh, this picture shows it fairly well. The, the engine compartment at the back. I think uh, some of this should have been black, uh, with the grey highlight. The same with the uh, this cog on his, his shoulder there. I think I maybe should have done that black instead of silver. If I, I think I've probably been a little bit lazy with the silver. I just airbrushed a straight silver and uh, used an oil pin wash to pick out the detail and give me a grimy look. It it works for a tabletop standard, but I think the the, the reality is most of you keen painters out there will spot straight away. Been a little bit lazy there. Um, I I should have gone in with a couple of different silvers, a light dry brush and the oil wash. And I think that would have looked looked a lot better. Um, mentioned the short shoulder joint I think that should have been black um, and I think this black gun guards uh, in hindsight uh, these were an absolute pig to fit after uh, building the sub assembly um, so I think uh, if I was to do the project again I would, lead, I would put those on to start with airbrush them all yellow to match everything else and then just pick out the gun barrels in silver uh, and do it that way around I think it would have been um, would have been a lot better uh, just another couple of pictures from different angles that that um, burnt barrel effect I'm really chuffed with that um, how that came out very uh, very pleased the uh, close up the face was quite quite happy with that so that's quite that's quite good. 
some of uh, some of you may have picked up I actually got the uh, highlights and the lowlights the wrong way around on the shoulder pads um, I didn't actually realize that until it was going round on the uh, on on the carousel um, but um, yeah overall I'm pretty happy the it matches everything it was a fun project um, I'm really keen to do more Imperial Fists um, but not really sure not knowing not knowing what's in an army not really sure what to do next uh, I've got a couple of primaries Marines and a captain but after that who knows um, maybe you guys can make some suggestions in the comments uh, that would be good uh, if you could leave us some feedback what do you think of the model anything like that that would be uh, greatly appreciated hope you've enjoyed this uh, really short clip and uh, stay safe everybody and have fun evil out